Sutherland Islands are so remote and so far away from traditional shipping lines that they have remained untouched. And when you jump in the water, it's like traveling back in time hundreds of years. This is the thing that we dream about when we are kids, you know, to go to a place that nobody has seen before, to explore something that is unknown. In 2009, we conducted our expedition, and since then, we have been talking with the president of Kiribati, President Tong, about the protection of these islands. And this year, in June of 2014, President Tong announced the protection of 12 nautical miles around each of the five islands. So the most precious part of those waters, the coral reefs and the islands, and the hotspots of biodiversity around them are now protected by the government of Kiribati in a marine reserve. The few pristine places left are so important because they are the only examples we have of an ocean without people. And they can show us how the oceans function. They can help us understand the true magnitude of the impact of our activities, what we have lost. But most important, these pristine places can show us what future do we want for the ocean.